taller than you look in the tabloids, Mr. Wayne. No gun. I'm insulted. You could have just sent a thank you note. I didn't come here to thank you. I came here to show you that not everyone in Gotham's afraid of you. Only those who know me, kid. Look around you. You'll see two councilmen. A union official, a couple off-duty cops, and a judge. Now, I wouldn't have a second's hesitation in blowing your head off right here and right now in front of them. Now, that's power you can't buy. That's the power of fear. I'm not afraid of you. Because you think you got nothing to lose. But you haven't thought it through. You haven't thought about your lady friend down in the DA's office. You haven't thought about your old butler. Bang! People from your world have so much to lose. Now you think, because your mommy and your daddy got shot, you know about the ugly side of life, but you don't. You've never tasted desperate. You're, uh, you're Bruce Wayne, the Prince of Gotham. You'd have to go a thousand miles to meet someone who didn't know your name. So don't, don't come down here with your anger, trying to prove something to yourself. This is a world you never understand, and you always fear what you don't understand. Yeah, you got spirit, kid. I'll give you that. More than your old man, anyway. In the joint, Chill told me, uh, told me about the night he killed your parents. He said your father begged for mercy. Begged. Like a dog. 